Alright you guys, welcome to the Get Vlogs. Thank you for watching and stay tuned. Alright, what's up YouTube? Good morning, good morning, good morning. Now, um, my inspirational quote is, Stay calm before the storm, key fam. Um, Sometimes it doesn't warrant you to be irate or upset about problems and situations that come about. Sometimes it just depends on what's your temperance and maintaining composure. So in order for success, sometimes you need to just be patient and Think things out morally before you get straight into whatever the problem or the issue is. Alright, so check me out. Now, I know you guys know about BGE. Where I live at is our main supplier for Baltimore Gas and Electric. So, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm here, I'm just going to be talking today about... A situation that happened yesterday. Well, yeah, yesterday. So, you know, one, a lot of us don't like talking to customer service. You know, or when you call or speak to customer service, you got to dial one, dial three, dial seven, dial eight. And then you normally after that, once you get to where you're going to go, as far as customer service, you got to wait. Seven to twenty minutes, sometimes a whole hour to talk to a customer service rep. So I'm a, uh, I'm gonna explain my situation, what happened yesterday, and y'all just let me know in the comments today about you know your situation. All right, so I'm getting ready to move. Me and my girlfriend, we getting ready to move to a new place. Moving on up, yeah, I appreciate y'all. But um, you know, I had to get my BGE switch from the current residence to my next residence. Now, I called BGE somewhere around like seven o'clock and went through the whole button pressing process to get to a live person. And I talked to one customer service rep. Now, mind you, I also talked to Two other customer service reps. But I was trying to get my BGE switched over. And the lady at BGE was like, nah, you wrong. Everything you telling me is incorrect. I can't do nothing for you. So finally, you know, like I said, stay calm before the storm. I got things situated. I got them situated and she said, do this, bop, 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 and then call back. Now... When I went to go do those things and I tried to call back, I called back and talked to another customer service agent. Now, this second customer service agent was rude as hell. Now, don't get me wrong. The first one was very rude, but I need the services, not them. They work at BGE. Their services going to be on. Now, the second, the second customer service agent I talked to, one, she was rude, but then at the same time, she proceeded to laugh at me. Nigga, ain't nobody got time for that. Come on, man. I don't have time for that. Because your BGE on, you nice and warm in the house. I'm not. So, like I said, once again, I had to make sure I kept down my mellow. Now... She proceeded to laugh at me, and I so happened to have it on speakerphone to the point where my girl started getting ivory. Now, I didn't already did this button pressing process twice at this point. At this point, it's now 1030. Now, mind you, like I told you, it's a long process. I'm so irate. I'm pissed off to the point where I'm about to explode because I'm just trying to switch my service from my current residence to the next residence. Now, I talked to the lady calm and everything. Because I'm trying to be calm. I'm about to, you know, 
get a little buzzed. But when she proceeds to laugh at me, my man, ain't nobody got time for that. Like, Lord knows, if I could have reached through the phone, I would have jacked her ass up because you laughing at a customer that needs help. But, you know, you're supposed to be the person that makes me feel comfortable in order to do these things. Frustrating. So finally, you know, I hang up. I, at this point, I'm like, the money I just paid on my BGE to have my service switched over, she not only, you know, took my money, but now she laughing at me. She like, you know what I mean? You can't do this. It ain't going to happen. So, you know, but God. So God comes in the, in the picture. He's like, my son, call again. So I call again. This time I'm like, I'm not getting off the phone to something is done. Finally, I get on the phone with a customer service agent after waiting almost 22 minutes. By this time, it's almost 11 something. So I talk to the customer ser service agent. I say, yeah, this, that, and the third needs to be done. And I say, you know, I was told this thing and once I do bit bop 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 bop, all of my services would be switched over, which I had done. I had completed my process. Now, she could have been just as ignorant as the first two customer service reps. Now, don't get me wrong, the first customer service rep, she was very ignorant, but she was at least respectful to enough, whereas though she got a point across to tell me exactly what I needed to do. The second one. She laughed at me. She thought I was, quite frankly, just funny. Like, I was the highlight of her day. Now, if y'all y'all dealing with these customer service agents, y'all know what the problem is. You feel me? So, finally, I talked to the last customer service agent. And we were on the phone probably for, probably for about a good half an hour, 45 minutes. Now... Not only did she meet everything that I wanted her to do, walk me through the step process and everything, but she did me a great justice. She got everything done on that one phone call that needed to be done. You know what I mean? Which made my day a little bit better because after all, yesterday was Valentine's Day. I want to be chilling with my boo. You feel me? But... You know, I just wanted to share this with you guys, like, and I mean, I can't speak to you guys out there on YouTube about problems and situations that befall me and to give you guys all these inspirational words if I'm not applying it to my personal everyday daily life. So, you know, if I leave you guys with anything, I want you guys to know one thing. Sometimes you got to be peaceful and if you at first you don't succeed, try, try again. You might not succeed the second time or the third time, but you find different ways to go about handling your problem and you will succeed. So, you know, be mindful of that, you know. Also, I wanted to just say to you guys today, um, you know, shout out to the producers and the makers of the movie called The Photograph. It was a really great movie. I'm going to leave a picture in the, um, at the end of this vlog uh, about the movie that I'm talking about. It just came out yesterday. I saw it last night with my, my fiance, my wife, my girlfriend, whatever. You know, whatever title you want to put to it. As far as I know, like, I love her. She loves me. We happy. We in a good place. But I just want you guys out here to go check that movie out, whether by yourself or with your girl or, you know, for my, you know, my cool people, you know what I mean? Which is significant other in general. Like, I'm not just going to put a label on it. This is not what we in the business of doing. But I just wanted to tell you you guys my situation. Um, if you guys watch this video, thank you for watching. I appreciate y'all. Uh, if you like the video, comment, subscribe, like, you know what I mean? 
And once again, I appreciate y'all, G fan. But this is just my feelings about the BGE process and dealing with customer service reps. All right. Peace out.